Oh, I, I, I think I would like the world to know that uh, it is certainly important to embrace your past, especially your uh, living relatives of your past. Mm -hmm. And uh, just as we're certainly trying to make young people uh, know that they need to look to their their As past Charlie, you, and their you, parents and especially their so grandparents and to hold them in in high esteem and reverence because uh, it does hold a lot and to your future. Heaven. Or it can. It yeah, can hold a lot yeah, to heaven. your future um, in terms of um, you know, knowing knowing where you come from mm -hmm. certainly gives you some uh, good direction as to where you're going, and uh, uh, even the bad. It's interesting because even the even the uh, not so <laughs> not so pretty and all that. It's certainly something that you can you can uh, smile about and and know that all that had a very important part uh, into helping to shape uh, you as an individual, whether you decided to. Um, you know, make a decision you to not be like again. some of the some of the characters or some of the characteristics, <laughs> or whether you I decide to embrace some of those I characteristics uh, of your past. So, I think it's I think it's um, very important for us to look yeah. look to the past, uh, just as uh, Thomas Jefferson said. Uh -huh. Not Thomas Jefferson, but uh, I'm sorry, um, Truman, Harry mm -hmm. Truman said. You know, if you forget the past, mm -hmm. then you're doomed to repeat it, okay, those negative things. I think we shouldn't forget the past, especially the good past, especially the good past.